Parts of Darwin's central business district have been evacuated due to a magnitude 7.2 earthquake in the Banda Sea. Reporter Jane Barden joins us now from Darwin. Jane, what's happening there right now? Well, the streets are quiet here in Darwin, but uh, just over two hours ago, hundreds of office workers, people from hotels and shops were being evacuated as uh, a quite strong tremor, 7.2, uh, was felt across the city. And basically, uh, there weren't scenes of panic, but people were quite worried and alarmed by it. Uh, it was felt as far away as Arnhem Land and also uh, inland as far as Catherine, which is 350 kilometres away, and also uh, in Dilly in East Timor. And that earthquake originated in the Banda Sea uh, of Indonesia, basically in the Ring of Fire, where there's a lot of uh, tectonic plate movement. Uh, so, yes, um, it's been a, a quite outstanding kind of level of uh, interest in this earthquake because we have regular small tremors but not usually anything as strong as this. Yeah, so the locals pretty alarmed by it. How did they handle the evacuation? Well, people who I've met on the street have said things like that they were in um, stairwells in tall apartment blocks which were swaying and they were quite um, frightened as they were coming down the stairs. Other office workers were saying things were falling off desks, etc. And these are some of the other comments of uh, Darwin city workers and residents. Oh, it just started shaking slightly and then it got worse. And then the doors started rattling and the glass was all rattling. And then we just got asked to leave. We were just in the shops and the shop started shaking and all the clothes and jewellery started shaking in the shop, so it was a bit weird. Uh, we were working up on the second floor and uh, we felt the building start to tremor, so um, yeah, quite scary. We went wow and then next thing it was the whole counter and then the lady said earthquake evacuate. And uh, any reports of damage or injuries? Um, there's been no reports of injuries from the ambulance service, but uh, one of the buildings that has been damaged is the main government health offices just behind me here, where engineers are checking the building and all the staff have been sent home for the day after large cracks appeared between the second and third floors. And we've also had some reports from residents across Darwin that cracks have uh, appeared in their house walls as well too. So a lot of buildings are going to have to be checked after this for safety. Jane Barden reporting from Darwin.